I'm Stuart Lawrence, Western Canada Territory Manager for Ag Leader Technology. And uh, we're here at the 2011 Western Canada Farm Progress Show in Regina at the Ag Leader booth. And we're standing beside an Ag Leader Integra display hooked up to an optic sensor system. And we're scanning some uh, wheat plants that we have growing in a pot, taking VI readings and simulating the, uh, the application of nitrogen on that crop. The optic sensor that uh, we have here. We're scanning a wheat crop. The crop is uh, at the three to four leaf stage and it's applying about 15 or 16 pounds of nitrogen. And what the sensors are doing, they're actively reading the vegetative index of the crop and then using an algorithm created by Ag Leader Technology to apply nitrogen as the crop needs it. The advantage that we have over other sensor systems that are on the marketplace is that Optrix is using three wave bands of red light that uh, it depends on the, on the crop that we're applying it on. But uh, we have three bands of red light that we use and that, that allows us to use the, the proper wavelength of red light for the crop and the crop stage whereas other sensors are only using one type of red light that can saturate at different crop stages and not give great results. Ag Leader has also got the ability to, with the sensors in the algorithm, we can have input from the operator and the operator can decide exactly what the sensor puts on. There's limits that can be put on the low side of the application and as well as the high side of the application or the operator can choose to go and let the sensor completely decide what rate is applied. And I think that's something that's unique in the marketplace. The sensor as compared to other systems that are on the market is newer and more refined and has some advantages that the other sensors don't have. The goal with the Optric sensor is to fine tune nitrogen application and that allows us to, to adjust for soils that are denitrified by excess of water or soils that don't have enough nitrogen release based on the organic matter of the, the soil itself. So a crop can find itself in two situations. It's not getting enough nitrogen because nitrogen has either been lost to the atmosphere through volatilization or it never had enough N release from the organic matter available in the soil. And the optic sensor will allow us, uh, allow the operator to come and fine tune their nitrogen application on wheat and corn so that they don't get too much nitrogen or they don't get too little and leave yield on the table. One thing that's unique about the optic sensor system is that we do not use a N-rich strip like other sensors that are on the market. We use a reference strip where the operator scans the crop for 300 seconds and the sensor picks out the best crop within that 300 second period and then the system compares the wheat that it sees to the reference strip and a nitrogen application is created from that. For more information on the Optrix system, growers can contact Ag Leader directly on the web. They can direct their browser to www.agleader.com.